Hey guys, what's up? It's Daniel with Trailer Mountain, and today I'm doing a little car camping. I'm up here at Figaro Mountain on the Central Coast, and I'm testing a few new products from a company called Sylvan Sport. Here's their website right here. Now, Sylvan Sport makes like car camping equipment. Uh, they also make other gear too, but mostly like car camping equipment, uh, and they take this kind of idea of car camping to the next level. So I have a few different videos that I'm going to be making. It's uh, about three videos in the Sylvan Sport video series. First, two videos kind of are going to go into one. So it's really going to be two videos. But I have the Cloud Layer Sleep System, and then I got something extra special that I'm going to show you on the next video. But today we're going to focus on the Cloud Layer Sleep System, which I have behind me. It's a self-inflating sleeping pad that's like super, super wide and uh, about four inches thick. It also has a uh, the stuff sack that it comes in, which is, I mean, it's massive. So the stuff sack that it comes in also doubles as a pump bag. So you can fill the sack full of air and kind of push it down and inflates the mattress. Um, and then we have the sleeping bag, which is like a full-on sleep system. Like it, the sleeping pad slides inside the sleeping bag. You have like a blanket and a sheet and a pillow and the whole bit. And it kind of, it's kind of like an open sleeping bag where you get in it and then you kind of pull it over yourself like a blanket. So super cool. Really can't wait to sleep in it tonight. Uh, it's not supposed to be very, very cold tonight, but it is rated to 20 degrees. That's what they say. Personally, I think it might get, it might get close to mid 30s tonight, maybe high 30s. But either which way, I'm not using the uh, rain fly on the tent tonight, so pretty much cowboy camping. I may just sleep outside cowboy camp style and go with that, but it's kind of buggy and I don't know, maybe. But there's a lot of stuff flying around right now. So without further ado, I'm going to flip the camera around behind me. We're going to get this thing out of the stuff sack. We're going to inflate it. I'll show you how big it inflates too. We'll get it inside the tent after we get it inside the sleeping bag. So let's get started. All right, so I got it on, I just put it on top of this cardboard box that it came in, so I didn't want to like jack it up. But here it is right here, this thing is huge. That's how wide this thing is, okay? It's not folded in half, that's how wide this sleeping pad is. And uh, what's cool about the stuff sack, as I said, there's your little air thing. So you can fill this thing full of air and it helps inflate the stuff sack. So here it is right here. This little Sylvan Sport logo, and it has another one on the bottom. Right there. Right there, that's sticky. So that's for the inside of the tent so it doesn't move around. See how wide that thing is. So I'm gonna get the pump sack on it. I do want to show you the valves though. So these just open just like that. There's two of them. Sorry, there's a bunch of red ants around. So you kind of just rotate these just like that. I don't know if you can hear that, but it's already starting to inflate. You can see it's starting to take form already. But we're going to put the pump valve, uh, the pump bag on it and inflate it even faster. What I'm going to do is I'm going to close one of these valves flip that around screw that tight do is you get this little guy and kind of just and you, and you kind of roll it once you get some air in there just like that Close the valve to the inflate part. Now, 
once you get that, kind of just get this little guy. This thing snaps in place too. So once it's in place, kind of just that a couple more times and this thing is done. And once it's clipped in place, and once it's inflated fully, you'll know because it you can't really inflate it anymore. There you go. So now it's fully inflated. Both valves are closed, but you can just see how. I mean, this thing is thick. And then we're sticking the Sullivan Sport logo on the bottom there. So, let me get this thing inside my tent here. But before I do that, I want to show you the sleeping bag. So here's the cloud layer sleep system. Um, before I get to that, that's the sleeping bag. But just look how wide this thing is. I mean, I'm six foot. And I have so much room on this thing. This thing is, it's like fit for a king. And it's really soft on the top here. This fabric on the top is super soft, totally supporting my body. Shoot, I might just sleep here, just like this. Good night. This is the cloud layer sleep system, single sleeping bag. Oversized and comfy with removable layers. So that's important. So we're gonna open this thing up as far as we can and get this bad boy out of here. Step that off to the side and let's see what this thing looks like. I have not taken this thing out yet, so this is exciting. Ooh. Okay. Wow. This looks cozy. It's got all kinds of stuff on the inside here. We'll get to that in a minute. Just take a look at that. Now the sleeping pad goes inside this sleeping bag on the bottom. I'll get to that in a second. I just want to kind of show you this. This is one sweet setup for car camping. All right, looks like I'm going to get this thing dirty a little bit. So without further ado, let's get this bad boy in there. So this guy goes in here. It's got a little sleeve. So, all right, so there it goes. Nice. All right, well, let's open this thing up. It's got nice little pull handles. It's got a little pocket on the side here. This thing just kind of opens all the way up. This kind of, I'll just kind of fold that off to the side, just like so. You have multiple layers. Wow, look at this. A little place for a pillow in here, drawstring hood. So, you have an organic cotton sheet here which has a snap on it, so you can remove that if you want, but we'll leave that on. It just kind of goes through and snaps in place. So you have multiple layers on this thing, which is great. So you have this cotton sheet. Next thing you have is this blanket, also Sylvan Sport logo. So that goes over it. 
and then you have your top sheet right here. So you have multiple layers um, for pretty much multiple seasons here. This thing is rated down to 20 degrees up to 60. So, uh, yeah, this thing is pretty sweet. And this zipper goes all the way through here, and you can actually remove this top layer. So this kind of comes off just like that. I don't know if you can see it, but the material on here is like really soft. Yeah, if you're just like... If you were just chilling around camp, and you wanted like a little blanket, you have one. So that's kind of cool. You can take it off. It's modular. When you want it put back on, you just zip it back in place. This one goes in here. All right, well, I'm gonna get in it because it looks super comfortable. Try to make sure I don't get any rocks in there. I'm not gonna get on in the sheet, but oh yeah. Oh this is nice. Oh. Yeah. Oh yes. Oh who knew? Who knew car camping could be this comfortable? Oh man, this is nice. It is pretty warm though, I'm not gonna lie. So, I'm gonna get out of it. And then we're gonna attempt to get this thing inside my tent, as is, in one big piece. <laughs> this thing is massive. Now this is a backpacking tent. Car camping tent would be much easier. Keep that in mind. And I did bring a pillow. All right, so it's all in there. I'll be snug as a bug in a rug tonight, that's for sure. This is a backpacking tent, as I said. So you can see that it hits the walls in the headboard and the footboard. It's not supposed to rain tonight, so it's not a big deal, but normally I wouldn't bring this uh, for a backpacking tent. This would be more of a car camping tent, which I did not bring, just because I wanted to try to stay minimal. I was just going for a couple nights, so yeah. So there it is. Just getting up, spent the night in the cloud layer sleep system. Uh, I really like the cloud layer sleep system. It's so wide and it's perfect for a two person tent. However, I would probably use a backpacking, or not a backpacking tent. I would probably use a uh, car camping tent instead because it's kind of a pain in the butt to get this big old behemoth inside and back out of a backpacking tent. Uh, okay, that being said, uh, I'm gonna get up, have some breakfast, literally just waking up. But I wanted to tell you how I how I felt and what I think uh, in the moment. So, yeah, pretty good. Good job, Sylvan Sport. Looks pretty awesome. Perfect for car camping. Super comfortable.